I was doing a talk today about self-administration of Valcade and the background was on that. We, were, we did a patient experience flow to see what was happening in our day units. Um, we were noticing that patients were spending over two hours of time from the time they were coming into the hospital to actually having the administration of the subcutaneous injection. They were feeling quite um, unimportant compared to other members that have patients that were coming through the day unit so we need to really address that also with all the new therapies that are coming through it's kind of like a funnel effect coming through the day unit so you've got um, an increase of all these patients coming through but the day unit capacity and nursing staff is not increasing with it so that was kind of our background and, our, and the reason as to why we were going to look into it so then we just needed to um, formulate a plan of looking at the stability of the drug um, looking at the SBC looking what research was out there and there was plenty of research that stated that the stability of the drug once it had been made um, it was okay at room temperature for eight days so working very closely with our MDT pharmacy we took it to quality and safety quality of control and they agreed a seven day would be appropriate then for our patients to um, be able to take it home and safely administer it it's quite a, a, a quite a robust structure what we do um, of with the patients for them to be taught the the administration of it so they'll come to the day unit first for their first cycle um, and then it's the second and subsequent squat cycles that they will then take those home next steps are we're working with our pharmacy to see the efficacy of the drug and the stability if we can try and get a 28 day expiry date from once it's been made and then what we're hoping is that it can include a, a, a broader amount of patients to be able to take a month supply home rather than even having to come in there so that is our next steps and and quite interestingly a question i was asked um, of maybe looking at the flow and the the benefits um, of patients who have now moved on how we filled that in the day unit, even though it's going to be quite easy to show how we filled it.